Right, well today I'm going to be doing a um, a Christmas ham. Now I bought this ham from the local butchers. Um, so yeah, we just uh, need to get it out of its packages and get it prepped up for a cook. Now. It's got quite a thick fat cap on that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this off and we're just going to trim that down a little bit and then we'll um, we'll retie it. So we need to get some of this off of this. I want to take it all off then you want to watch your fingers That's, there's too much fat cap on there so get rid of the hard skin You can always say if you like it crackly, you can always um, always just pop this in the oven and um, cook it separately. Okay, so got some cloves of garlic here, which I'm just going to uh, just break up a little bit, drop in. Don't have to go too mad with these, there's a few. Just drop those in. Just crush it down. I just tend to smash it with my hand, just drop it in. Um, got some peppercorns here. Drop those in. And I've got some, some cloves, some whole cloves. So, a few of those. So, a few more of those. And just drop these in there. A lot of people do stock vegetables and stuff like that, but I'm not going to do that with this. So we're just going to leave that as it is. Right, got the um, the ham out of the water and discarded the water, so we got rid of that. Um, and now what I want to do is score this. So. Not too deep. I'm going to go across this way. Like this. That's it. Hope that that will stick to it. Dry my hands a little bit. Just try and get this on as even as you can. Be covered in uh, some honey later on and a little bit of marmalade. There's that gammon. Close that for a second and then I'll get a temperature probe in. Right, well we've got a temperature probe in um, and we'll let that take on some smoke now. 
So I've got a bit of apple wood in there. You can use cherry. I've just used a bit of apple wood, so not too heavy a fragrance. Right, we've been on for a couple of hours now. Uh, internal temperatures are 146, so I'm going to uh, put some glaze on. Right, so in here we've got a um, some marmalade like a marmalade jam and I've also um, just grated an orange and put some orange, half an orange in there as well just to give it a little bit more zest so get that and just just going to pour some of that on it's got some honey in there as well I'll pour a little bit more honey on that later on, but we'll just get a little base on there now. Okay, so there we have it, um, my Christmas ham, um, easy to do, and cuts, well, really nice, um, nice and juicy, and this should last for a few days, and um, it's going to taste delicious, I'm sure, let's have a quick taste of it. part oh lovely well I hope you like the video see you in the next one